To build a microsite, go to the design menu and choose microsite. Then click on new basic setup and click dealer microsite and click next. Choose the template you prefer, which in this case will be ADT dealer microsite no form. And now select the file name by typing it into the blank and click open. Okay, we will now begin building the microsite. Click on header to choose the header strip at the top. In this case it will be a generic ADT dealer header, but you can choose the name of your dealership or any number of other headers that are available. And click save to continue. Now click 2 to select a feature product. This is the large product that will appear at the top. And now make sure you're in the global images folder, if not already, and then select the subfolder appropriate for these large images, which would be Microsite eBlast large products, the feature products. Choose one that you like and click OK. You'll notice that in the preview this graphic appears at the top. You can now choose a coupon code associated with this if this is an offer or a coupon. In this case we will give it a coupon code but not everything needs a coupon code. You can leave that blank if there is none associated with the particular offer or product. So now we'll choose our second product which is the smaller product below the main one on the left. Again make sure you're in the global images folder and choose the subfolder appropriate to this which would be the microsite sub small folder with and we'll choose an offer folder so we choose an offer we like and click OK again we can enter a coupon code associated with this so we type that into this text area and you can change the color or the size or the alignment of the, this coupon code text if you like. But in this case, we're just going to leave it black. We pick a third product, which is the smaller image to the right of this, below the main feature product area. And again, in Global Images folder, we choose a subfolder appropriate. In this case, we're going to choose a lifestyle graphic. We're going to choose a, a baby sub lifestyle graphic. Now since this is not a coupon or an offer there's no coupon code associated with it so we can just leave that blank and no coupon code will appear below this graphic. Now we can choose a footer. In this case we'll choose a generic ADT dealer footer and we can type in the phone number of the dealership and this will be reflected in the footer graphic. Okay, now we can type in a disclaimer that appears at the bottom. You have up to 4,000 characters to enter any disclaimer information that you need. Again, you can choose type size, font color, alignment, and styling if you wish. Now we can choose a background graphic that will appear behind the website. This, this won't appear within the main website, but if the image is, uh, does not fill up the user's entire browser window, this will appear in the background. So you choose the folder the same way that you've chosen the others. This time select Microsite Backgrounds and choose a graphic and click OK. You've now completed the process of building a microsite. If you'd like to see what your finished microsite would look like in a web browser, you can click the Preview button and you will get a sample.
Take a good look at your preview and make sure that all the information is correct because this will be your finished microsite.